Hello all, welcome back to our channel. So students, Usmania University has released the revaluation re notice update. So in this video, I will give the full clarity how you should apply and uh, is there any possibility of getting the pass marks for the failed subjects, everything in detail we will discuss in this video. If you skip the video means you will not understand and you will not get the answers of your questions. So watch this video fully then you will understand it in a better and the useful way. Okay. So now we will discuss about the unit uh, notification. Okay. Notification has been released by Usman University of BA, BCom, BSc, BBA. Every stream of first, third and fifth semester revaluation as well as the photocopy. Revaluation means your they will evaluate your paper again like recorrection photocopy means they will send you the your booklet your booklet through postage okay so there is a difference between photocopy and revaluation so according to me revaluation only you should apply it okay so everyone who were commented and who were messaged me personally that they were uh, failed in some of the language subject english subject something kind of thing my suggestion is you should keep revaluation compulsory per subject revaluation amount is 500 for photocopy re uh, the amount is 1000 rupees okay so how many subject you have failed it is a secondary matter but you should apply revaluation re for failed subjects okay don't make any like uh, i will save money like that type of kind of thing you should not have so just apply all the subjects which you got less on failed subjects okay from 27th february onwards it will start collecting the revaluation re and photocopy application from you okay now where you should apply this revaluation re you should take your hall ticket and your money and your student identification card like your school uh, college id and go to your college and uh, there you will have your management administration staff right there you need to inquire about the revaluation re process or else or else you can go to any nearby net centers or Seva to apply this revaluation re okay so 500 per subject it will take and service charge they may take or 50 or 100 rupees okay just your hall ticket number is important okay from 27th february onwards without late fee till up to march 5th you are having revaluation re chance till march 7th you are having the chance for photocopy for one subject it is thousand rupees so photocopy is waste thing ma just go for the revaluation re only okay compulsory revaluation re you need to apply and with the late fee of 200 means after march 5th if you want to apply for the revaluation re extra 200 you need to pay okay so 500 plus 200 total 700 okay like that you need to pay per subject okay not per per subject if you are, want to make a revaluation re for two or three subjects for example two subjects 500 500 thousand plus late fee 200 total 1200 like you need to pay in me seva centers or net centers or in your college okay only cash you need to pay them mode of payment will be the cash okay so next after revaluation re revaluation re means i said no recorrecting your paper sometimes usmania university or any other university will do mistake regarding the students if you have written your examination well also sometimes this problem may arise in the student's life okay so after if you are applying the revaluation re while recorrecting your booklet expert faculties those who are having 20 years or 18 years of expert faculties will be there no they will correct your papers whether you are whether you have written the correct answers for that correct answer whether the marks is allotted correctly according to the answer whether it is not they will check okay and one more thing i want to tell you all means if you got any one of the subject a or a plus don't apply for revaluation re to get o grade because 
uh, some of the students have messaged me personally that ma'am in every subject i have got uh, o o grade but it, in this subject only i have got only a grade or a plus grade i will apply for revaluation ma'am then i will get o grade in that subject also like that they have uh, asked me so my suggestion is if you want to apply means you can apply but my suggestion is no because revaluation process will be useful for the students those who have failed in the subjects it is a better opportunity or the second chance where they are getting to evaluate their paper second time in that time if you are applied for revaluation to get o grade you have written the answers as it is which you have mentioned as it is which it is there in the booklet also you will not at all get o grade or uh, a plus after getting the evaluation if you got b or b plus grade in any of the subjects you can apply for revaluation i hope that everybody got everybody got the clarity regarding the revaluation notice because uh, from past two or three days everybody is uh, uh, asking me personally also so those students who got f in their subject that is promoted or failed in the subjects don't worry ma just you apply for revaluation i want to tell one incident that when i am pursuing my degree my friend she is the topper of my class <clears throat> okay so in our uh, fourth or fifth semester it may be uh she got secured full on full marks like a plus o grade only in every subject but uh, in one subject she got f she were very much tensed and we also we understood why it is happening after that she applied for revaluation and she got o grade in that subject sometimes mistakes may happen by the university side also you no need to worry and don't get tensed and don't get uh, like uh, angriness or uh, like this type of uh, anxiety ness just be calm accept the situation and apply for revaluation definitely you will get passed in the subjects and you will get the good grades in your subjects particular subjects which you are applying in the revaluation okay after revaluation also if you were not uh, cleared the subject means you need to write the backlog examination when will be the backlog examination we will discuss in the further videos i hope that we have you have got clarity regarding the revaluation notice okay so this is all about the video students if you are having any further doubts after watching this full video also you can comment me in the comment section definitely i will try to answer each and every comment because i am not having time to give uh, replies to the comments because i am also having my pg examinations is going on just now i have came so that's why i am very much like tired so if you are having any further doubts also you can message me in the comment section definitely i will try to answer it okay all the very best students again i'm saying don't worry so whatever happened is happened don't get tense and be concentrate on your next semester okay all the very best and thank you so much students